this fucking Oh my gosh, man. This is PvP, my dog shit. I'm taking this game more serious than my fucking life because I'm a fat fucking virgin. Oh my gosh, guys. Fuck you. What's up, fellow gamers? It's Use. Today, I will share with you what I have learned in my many hours spent playing this game so you can be an absolute god at Insurgency Sandstorm, just like me. Go mentally deranged, yeah? Go brainless, yeah? Go wacky? Go positively bonkers, yeah? Insurgency Sandstorm is the first game in the series to have a character customizer, but don't be fooled by its simple appearance, there is a meta, you must make a female character. Why you may ask? Well besides from the fact that I, a seasoned Insurgency player told you so, in certain countries like China, the female characters are censored out and rendered invisible to players in that region, giving us capitalists an advantage over the evil communists. After creating your female character, you now must make an insurgent who sadly don't have a female option because insurgents reproduce by budding and evolve past the need for women, so I won't tell you what to do here. After creating your magnum opus, you can now play the game. Don't worry about the tutorial because this video is far superior. The next step in single-handedly being responsible for the mass genocide of the enemy team is the loadout you decide to make. Now what you should do is buy as much stuff as the budget would allow so that your life will matter more than those who spent less money simply because you have better, more expensive equipment. This is how it works in the military in real life too, because money is more important than you and your pathetic life will ever be. Now after creating your loadout that weighs about the same as a 12 year old child, you can finally kill people. I find the best ways to make blood exit other people's bodies is to either A, play the game like it's Call of Duty and run into rooms guns blazing, which will get you anywhere from 0 to 5 kills before you inevitably die, or B, be a big pussy and play marksman and prone on an elevated surface far from harm's way while slowly aiming at new and confused players taking a leisurely stroll to the objective, which is great and all, until you're the last player alive and your team is calling you mean names behind your back. Names like Pussy, Retard, Poopy Face, and worst of all, New Jersey Resident. All while you cry in the corner of the capture point. Or C, you can be a big nerd and put effort into the game and use tactics and look up guys on the internet. But it's really pointless since a player is only as good as their team and your team is already dead. Except for you and the two marksmen on your team. Now teamwork is a very important part of Insurgency Sandstorm, and the best way to brew team chemistry is to have good, effective communication. Mary, 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 my mom is gay. Is a girlfriend hot? It's their arm, it's just not as fun when they have guns. Dude, uh, the security team likes pee pee. Security team likes big old pee pee. They're not getting pee pee shoved in If you have an active social life, like myself, you can invite your friends to play with you because everything is better with a good friend by your side. Now let's get into classes. The commander is for people who aren't afraid of responsibility and are natural leaders, just like the person I wish I was, which explains why no one wants to play this class in casual. 
Observer is just a commander's pet dog. Rifleman is for people who are scared of change. And my personal favorite, Breacher, is a brave warrior that always dies first. The Gunner is for people who love recoil. Demolitions make very loud noises that scare the enemy so bad they separate into multiple pieces. And the Advisor is just a rifleman with funky guns. And Marksman? Marksman's for pussies, and they can't even aim. Please subscribe so I can get the attention I so rightfully deserve and leave a like if you left this video a little smarter and if you didn't leave one anyways my self esteem depends on it and if you feel like it leave a comment on why I should delete my channel after uploading my first video after all I appreciate any human contact I'm so lonely please comment my video I have no friends they don't want to play in Sturgency Sandstorm with me